Now at 6, a community is mourning the loss of a man after he was shot and killed Sunday in Odessa. Good evening, I'm Carson bush -Yost. And I'm Madeline Bierster. ABC Big 2's Rachel Hallam joins us now live at the Ector County Sheriff's Office tonight. Yeah, Rachel, the friends of that victim, that man, are devastated by this sudden loss. was identified as 19-year-old Mauricio Islas from Odessa. Mauricio's friends say they are in complete shock and cannot even begin to comprehend the loss of someone so close to them. He was a very friendly person, more than friendly. He was a very honest person, very honest, very humble before all of his qualities. On Sunday night, the Ector County Sheriff's Office says they received a call around 1030 about an accident near the intersection of West 16th Street and Tim Tam Circle. When deputies arrived, they say they found 19-year-old Mauricio Islas with a gunshot wound to his torso. ECSO says he was then taken to the medical center hospital and died from his injuries. A close friend of his, Yaeli Ramos, says she's at a loss for words and can't even begin to describe the pain she feels. The truth is, it's a very difficult moment that we are all living in. It's still hard to believe that he's gone because it's not something easy or similar to lose a friend. It's something very difficult, you know, to accept. She says Islas was the best friend anyone could have asked for and he was always there for everyone. She says he always had a smile on his face. Being a part of a team, never leaving a friend alone. He was a very cheerful person, more than happy. Pain Paying attention to my problems, he didn't show the sadness he felt for all the problems he carried. Ramos says Islas had such a bright future ahead and that his family was everything to him. And now it's all been stripped away. He was a very hardworking person. He was a man who had dreams, goals, and many goals to accomplish. His main prayer was his family. His mother, most of all, his mother was his great treasure. Above all, she was always first. The last week we spoke and I went out with him. He was telling me that he was going to buy a house for his mother. He always told me that his mother loved him very much. She says Islas will be missed by everyone and that his memory will live on forever. There's not going to be a day when we don't think back to you. And there's no doubt that you won't leave a hole in sports, in family parties, in everything that characterized you as a person. We will never forget you. We will always remember you. ECSO says the suspect responsible for shooting Islas was arrested and released the same day of the shooting on a $250,000 bond. Reporting live in Odessa, Rachel Hallam, ABC, Big 2 News.